Hey there guys and welcome back. Uh, I was talking to Belnergan because he had asked ways to counter the Skellige, the Skellige Curse Skellige deck that's going around right now on Reddit. So I made this post about Dry Pass and was by Sart 1 because it really sucks when it happens to me and they usually end up winning that way. Well, in the Vivacard Medics resurrecting the bears so he ended up making this deck like real quick i guess and he posted it to me and it actually if anything it seems fun he says it's been working out really well for him but we're gonna try and find out um but it does definitely look fun <laughs> it's a little it's i got alchemy without the witchers um <laughs> we got okay alchemy package here with instead of witchers you're running vivacaro vicavaro medics Resurrect a bronze unit from your opponent's graveyard. I mean, against Skellige, yeah, it's good. But against other decks, it can also be good when you got the Slave Drivers in there, too. This is like a less trolly version of that I like your deck nilf card I made. This is like an actual... This one seems like it could actually work. So that's why I'm excited. And this guy, yeah, this guy lets you steal more cards that your opponent's using. So you could use their deck against them more. Then we got Summoning Circle and Cantarella because you're running a Disloyal, so yeah, you're running Summoning Circle. Surprise. Surprise there. Uh, decoy. Replay Bronzer Silver Ally and boosted by three. He's got some good decoy targets. Peter, Swears, even Azure in some cases. Most likely Peter, Swears, or like a Slave Driver or Medic are your best ones. Or even Novice. Like, all these choices are great for a decoy, in my opinion. And depending on the situation, it's like a situational decoy instead of just using it for that Barclay or a Tori. Then we got Peter Gwenleave, reset an ally and strengthen it by 3, or reset an enemy and weaken it by 3. This gives you another reset target. Or say you didn't get your Regis Letho combo, which is killer, uh, you can at least reset the Letho with him. Then we got Swears, choose an enemy or revealed unit in your opponent's hand and move all copies of it from their deck to their graveyard. Swears is great. Swears just shuts down, completely shuts down some decks because he's crazy. Um, as, as at least if they're relying on that one card, like Hensel Machines, when they shuffle all those machines back in their deck, then you swears it and you put them back in their graveyard. They're like, well, that sucks. Um, or of course, consume the one that relies on copying Neckers a ton, which is why I don't like running that version. And then we got Azjar. Turn two bronze or silver cards from either graveyard and to their respective decks. You can use this to return cards to your deck, sure, but uh, he put it in here because I mentioned that Olgird. If you put use Azjar to put Olgird back in their deck, that's really annoying too. <laughs> so I think that's why he put it in here. But you can also use it on your stuff because I mean, you got Vivacarva novices. So if you run out of these or something, you can put like ointments back in your deck and reuse them for some crazy shenanigans. Then your disloyal unit. Royal Decree, play a gold unit from your deck and boost by two. This gives you a little bit more consistency on the Regis Letho Carher, which they're all one powers. <laughs> they're all one power golds. Oh, I just realized that. It's funny. He was running Igni, but he was testing around with Vilk Forts too, because he said the Igni doesn't work so well. So I went with Carher, because John Calvet and Carher's fun times. Uh, you could run Vilgforge too, it probably has some success, but I, with my luck, he'll play something I don't want him to play. So, like grabbing my Letho at the wrong time. <laughs> but he could work out really well, which is one of the cards I suggested. So, Carher instead, Resurrect the Leader, Resurrect that John Calvet, reactivate his ability. Always good times. Letho, lock two units on a row, then drain all their power. Spying. This Letho Regis combo is basically a more powerful succubus with two golds. If this is your last two cards, then there's like no way to shut it down besides scorching yourself. Like you can scorch yourself after they letho you and just that way they don't get the bonus Regis value, but that's about it. So letho and Regis really good because if you're facing consume, yeah, you're obviously getting a ton of value out of this. If you're facing anything else, I mean even dwarfs, you can lock two 12 power units 48 power play and 2 golds, that's 224 power golds. Like, that's pretty good. Um, and of course, against Skelliga, you lock 2 Marauders, drain all their power, then you get a ton of power. So, 
The Regis and the Letho combo, definitely, definitely really killer. And I haven't gotten to mess around with it yet, so we got that. And Regis drain all boosts from a unit, that's why it works, because Letho boosts himself when you lock the two units and banish them. And then Regis drains all the power from the Letho and boosts himself up a crap ton. So then, yeah, John Covet, look at top three cards from your deck and then play one. Pretty good card. So, get into some games, and well. Test this deck out. Alright, game one, King Bron. I shall not repeat Amir's Probably the Skellige Skellige Ooh. Skellige combo. Throw back mock mail first. Then poultice. That's cool. Pay attention now. I wager this you want Then poultice again? Yeah. Pay attention now. I want you to Pay close attention. Alright. We don't have Azure to shuffle Olgeard. Or, yeah, Olgeard into his deck. We all err at times. Even I do. Is he just checking out the emotes? So... Do not what do we want to go here with? For weakness. Probably John killed that. This time. Well, it looks like Azure. I shall be as you claim. Hmm, not good at all. You have no slave drivers. That's that's really unfortunate. <laughs> War at last. <laughs> Wait a minute, is this Siri Nova or something? Let's go with novice. Don't double pull this me now. Okay. The heck is I've never ran into an emo spammer like this. They don't like you. Well, let's let's try to ping those off so we do it, we can res them with novices at least medics. So let us fight out the war round a little bit longer. Scorch. Got that rather quick. My prescription, a bit of bloodletting. We probably just decoy the medic and take his other bear. Well, now he's debating on what to do. <laughs> I don't think he was expecting that. Now our poultices can grab a spare too, but I mean, slave drivers are usually more fun. That's... Odd card to run. Hold on to the decoy, or medic going to be the best decoy target anyway. I'll decoy the medic. My prescription. Take his other bear. Mmm, nothing left in his deck to take for now. Is it worth it to novice? Come on, mock mail. Ooh, thank you. I'm gonna grab another one of those. Is this Siri Nova or something? Like, what is this? I guess we'll drop the Cantarella. No one can hide from me. Summoning Circle. Take that.
could use the combo, but no. <laughs> We're gonna save on to that combo. Hopefully I see some slave drivers now. I have three of them. There's one. There's two. Look at that. Um, what am I gonna want to copy from him? Like... Nothing really unless he disloyals us, but... Discard another one? Alright, well we're gonna... Medic out his last bear here. My prescription, a bit of blood letting. We can't revive those at least. Pulled the series out for some reason though. I think I'll just go slave driver. Yeah, Priest Frey, why not? Res a bear. But she brooks no now we have all his bears. <laughs> he has no bears. Confused what kind of deck he's running. He must be... No, because he runs three bears, so he can't run. We're going to hold on to this... Peter, because I don't want a royal decree and see um, Carr. I mean, throw away royal decree and see Carr. So let's go, Slave Driver. Oh, well, we finally got the bad choices. We'll discard. We have one of those so we can. One, two, we can triple medic. Yeah, we can pull off that combo if we leave the mock males in there. Probably just get rid of the novice. More at last. <laughs> More, my Run some weird discard deck. That's for sure. Go with novice. Ointment. Into novice. Now, how did that incantation go? To ointment. Into novice. Huh, that was to ointment. Close. And now we'll grab Slave Driver. I guess we'll take in a bear. So we Royal Decree car her last three cards we get to choose from now. You've sailed into troubled waters, mate. You got a decent chunk of damage with that. Not sure what I'm going to use this Peter for yet. Play Carter, Ezrek John Calvet. Summoning Circle, that. So this, that's guaranteed 12. This is risky. Do we really need more units on the field? Ooh, I could benefit plus three on this, or it could totally bust. Hopefully it doesn't hit that one to the right. All right. He hasn't played anything with boosts. So we're probably just going to reset this guy. Took away all his bears, that's probably annoying him. Annoying me.
Probably an Igni, right? She has Final Say, so... Let's see, that's going to be plus 16, so we probably want to play around the Igni on that one. I'm going to reset this guy and strengthen him. Remus Bear? Put it on back row. Actually, it doesn't matter because whichever row you put it on, those are two I'm locking. So either he scorches himself for 20 or we get a 40 point play here. That was neat. We locked what? An 8 and 11? Two twenty point golds. That's pretty good. I'm gonna restore the Marauder. It's your last card, Siri Dash. Is this like Siri? Just so confusing. Oh, we're gonna drain the Letho's power. No, no, not enough. <laughs> we won that one. <laughs> we'll take that one. Oh, we wait. What was his name? Iris is my sis. Oh, Iris is my sis. And then he's got the dope guardian border too. That's funny. Um, yeah, that's a game one. We pulled off the Leo Letho combo and we stole all those bears. So, <laughs> not sure what he was going for, but it was a good one. So we'll take that one. Get the next one. Game two, another King Bron. This one might be Skellige one we thought the last one was going to be. Wow, look at that last two cards again. Crazy. Let's throw this back. Hmm. Throw the Summoning Circle back, I guess. I want to hold on to this Medic. This decoy, this world decree is nice, Azure is nice. What am I gonna swears on him? I guess we'll keep this. Maybe it's bears or something, but if I put bears in there, then restore is like, ugh. Me or me. <laughs> what the heck? This is not the one again? Zolgird. What is this deck? Is this some new deck? I'm trying to make work. We'll steal this guy. Let's be Siri Nova. Hmm, playing medic right now sucks. Cause I'm gonna buff this guy up anyway. You just decoy the slave driver. Try to get a ship. Go John kill that. Try to get another slave driver. Or these horrible choices. Summoning circles honestly the best thing to take. We'll put them both on the same row so that way Makamel doesn't hit them both. I think this is top two, so that's going to be a poultice either way. Jeez. Rough. Well, there's his ship, so we're going to. Come on, stalkers! We ride! Send that to his graveyard. He might. He might. Clan Corsair here, which would be slightly annoying. The time for is past. No, okay. 
So now we get to medic his ship. So we can't use that. It's so now he only has one ship to work with. Oh, never mind. Now he has two ships to work with. <laughs> oh, that is rough. I think we... Oh, that's a poultice, though. That's double poultice from this guy. That sucks. Shuffle a little gear back into his deck. Now let's decoy the slave driver. Let's let's try to steal another ship here. Hey, here we go. Now we can keep up with his dumb combo. Don't have much more to play, I mean... Oh, and he runs Ragnarok? Crazy man. Guess we'll Azure. Up here to lessen the chance of... Machmail kind of screwing us. Shuffle old gear back into his deck and decoy back into ours. We have a huge Igni here. <laughs> Anyone else see that? That 11, 11, 11? I wish I knew if these guys were top of the deck. Because I know two poultices are on top of my deck right now. He's going him. Wait, that shuffles, right? The hatred for us will never wane. Pretty sure that shuffles, so we should have a chance. Pulling off a good mock mail. Wait a minute, did he just create a Peter from our deck? Well, that's sad. Let's pass here. I have to get those ships away from them. I need more medics. <laughs> and plus, I don't want to take the chance with that double poultice sitting on top of my deck if it is. Yeah, double poultice. We'll see if he wants to fight this out. Nope. Um. Just thinner deck out of the mock mail. Because we can use all those poultices, I think. And then we can, like, eat his ship and. That combo. That combo. If we don't see these, like, we need a, we need a medic. We need a medic, not, not that. Medic. Uh, I guess we'll go Slave Driver first, because I can't take the risk. Resurrect a Bronze Soldier, or Resurrect a Bronze Machine. Go with that to Resurrect one of these. What do you need? Okay, there's the one we're targeting. So we Royal Decree, Carver, try to get a Medic out of this, hopefully. Medic. Medic. We use that. 
A bit of blood to take. Is Clam Creek Greatsword? Yeah, we'll take his other Clan Creek Greatsword. He's probably going to Clan Corsair into the ship. Which I couldn't steal both of them, so I couldn't really stop that, but now I can Letho combo. So here... Poultice into Novice. And I picked the wrong one. That's dumb. That really hurt. Because the left option on Talisman is the... <laughs> is the resurrecting thing, and that one is not. Ah, oh, man. Ointment. Do it right this time. Slave driver, go. Back in line. Guess we'll grab another ship here. Question is, is it worth it to drop my Letho a little bit early? Or to wait for this? Oh, no, Slave Driver's not going to die, so we'll go Novice. Now, how did that Mock a male. Don't hit the middle one. Ah. Okay, now he's gonna decoy a Sigdrifa. So I guess we lock the two ships. No, I'll let one of his ships go. Gotta hand it to you. Good work. And that's about to be a huge Regis right there. 64 point Regis. I was gonna laugh that Commander's Horn hit him. <laughs> so we'll take the Leo here. Man, that combo's crazy. 64 power. That was two 32 point golds. We have his machine here. Like, it would have been nice to steal his ships and everything, but no. He he was like, yep. Not coming back from that with anything. <laughs> well, that's, that's, that's game two. Let's get in the last one. I would be so infuriated by facing this deck, actually. Now that I think about it with the not medics and everything, steal my stuff. And Okay, here we go. Probably going to lose this one. It's Foltest. It's like one weakness, I think, because you had nothing. What are you going to take from him? They have like nothing that you want. <laughs> Guess I could use Peter. Peter maybe. Summoning circle for his disloyal unit wars that were probably gonna happen. Throw Peter back for now. Alright, another medic. Well, time to pull absolute crap. Oh, siege support. Look at that. He doesn't run absolute crap. Ronvid. Ah, let's try this again. Maybe we can pick up another one. Could go Reaver Scout into my last slave driver. I told you so, you idiot. Move. 
Yeah, into another siege port. All right. Salutations. <laughs> He's gonna start trying to kill these off, so we gotta get some mock males out there. Now, how did that incantation go? But we're broke as shit pedal. Another bad room. That one brings that one to five, so I mean I could throw this little unit over now. Hmm. Well, let's see what this gives us. Poultice or mock mail? Poultice, the slave driver. Oh, don't, don't mess this one up. <laughs> Alright, we got another one of these, so... Play the Reaver Scout, grab out another one of these. And then we'll go with Mock Mail. Pretty sure that sets us up just fine. Send out a Decaton, too. <laughs> oh! It's a fun deck, guys. Uh, I definitely suggest you try it out. I'm gonna... <laughs> I mean, it might not be competitive, maybe. Because, I mean, you're, you've got to face... Maybe it will be. I mean, Jesus, those games didn't go too bad. And that left... If you get that Leo-Letho combo... With having all that stuff of just like, Oh, I like your deck. I'm gonna take the best things from your deck and just use it. And then take them from your graveyard so we can't revive them. And be really annoying so <laughs> it's definitely the most annoying deck I, I would not want to face this deck I would get so mad facing this deck I would probably forfeit as early as that guy did after that crap like really two Katawani sergeants and two reaver scouts to filter out all my slave drivers all my medics and just get major value off it into my mock veil so like my deck was guaranteed i didn't even drop my leader yet jesus oh wow the deck spawn guys let me know if you guys try it out and how you like it that's crazy all right i'll see you guys in the next one till then have a good one